The enchantment of natural beauty lies beneath the shadow of life in the land of the Golden Axe, the Kingdom of Thailand. Widely known to tourists from all over the world on their journey to pay a visit to this unique beauty. From the wide open seashore of thousands of kilometers of the southern part to the forests in all parts of Thailand, the perfect tune of life has been created with happiness as the valuable gift from nature to all creatures in the country for a long time. And also, there are plenty of outstanding plants waiting to reveal their unique identities, colors, and fragrances. Native Thai orchids are among them, and they are known as the gems of the forest. With over 30,000 species, the orchid is a member of monocotyledon plants with the most biodiversity and distribution among multicellular plants found in the world, especially those in the region of Southeast Asia. Orchids have always amazed their admirers for a long time. The outstanding bio-identity is that an orchid is a monocotyledon plant with different morphology from other groups of plants, such as the general root of the plant functions as an absorbent and supports its stalk. But for some orchids, the green root with chlorophyll is capable of photosynthesis in order to provide its own food. One notable scientific fact is that the orchid is the most evolutionary flower in the world, as its special character of colorful petals, which draws insects, acts as a pollination carrier. Thus, the special petal or lip also helps insects in pollination, which can increase the opportunity of distribution to many places more than other kinds of plants. In Thailand, native orchids grow in all types of vegetation with habitats ranging from evergreen forests, deciduous forests, and limestone. Thai orchids can be categorized into distinct growth forms as follows. Terrestrial orchids are orchids that grow in the ground in soil humus, or other organic matter. We also found that some of the ground orchids are saprophytes as they have no photosynthesis pigments and absorb the nutrients from organic matter of dead organisms. Epiphytic orchids Suited to hilly, semi-evergreen forests, the epiphytic plant has upright stem and climbing growth habits with its outstanding aerial roots to attach to nearby trees and also help photosynthesis and absorb moisture from the air. Lithophytic orchids with strong root and stalk. They squeeze into the rock plate to support their stalk and absorb water and nutrients from the rock plate, which could be found in all ecological zones of Thailand. Aquatic orchids found in swampy wetland areas. The orchids specialize to adjust themselves to survive with a silt root system to raise the stalks right to the sunlight or have the aerial root system to increase oxygen. Some are found by the stream banks of evergreen forests. Some native Thai orchids are also notably recognized as rare and endangered species plants with fewer records found around the world, such as Coribus acorinatus. This kind of orchid has its habitat in the southern part of Thailand and has disappeared for a long time. There is only one record found in Thailand, this Paris neogorensis. This orchid is very small and only half a centimeter in diameter and six centimeters high stalk. 
there are few reports of it found in not many provinces in Thailand. And with such a small size, the orchid is of higher risk to be stepped on. Besides those rare species, some orchids are more colorful, beautiful, and give better fragrance than others. Their characteristics are developed and improved, both in color and fragrance, by humans, such as the Cattleya orchid, which is named the queen of orchids, and symbolizes all kinds of orchids. One of the improved and developed Cattleyas with white petals and golden yellow spots was later given the name by Her Majesty the Queen of Thailand as Cattleya Queen Sirikit, as Her Majesty has given much support to conserve the forest and Thai native species. This beautiful orchid is then the symbol of Thai Women's Day up to the present. With their unique and beautiful look, hardly found in other plants, orchids are exported to the world market. Thailand is the second largest exporter of orchids to the world, but the number one largest exporter of tropical orchids to Japan, USA, and many European countries as the major business partners. Export values increase steadily every year. Many of us might see orchids several times in the vase as a venue decoration or offering to the Buddha. But there might be a few people who keep searching for its enchantment as the gem of the forest in order to maintain its value to exist along with the natural beauty of our beloved Thailand as long as it lasts.